Hi guys, welcome to Daisy Design Face Painting Tutorial. Tutorial. We're going to do it all the pink princess mask. mask. Cool. All right, thanks, Mandy. We're going to get straight into it. I'm going to. I've put a um, bit of white shimmer just over the eyelids. And I'm going to get some of this um, brilliant bling, bling cake from Silly Farm. And I'm going to pick up just a couple of colours on that side. Especially that sort of gold. And I'm going to go around the, just the corner of her eyes. This is just sort of the base of the design. And I'll do the same thing on the other side. So we've got a nice, nice shimmery, sort of autumn coloured. Design base to work from. Right, the next step is um, making the branches for our autumn tree. So I've got a bit of brown, I'm going to load that onto my brush as well as a bit of black. So we sort of almost double dip like you do with double dip flowers. Double and we're going to. Flowers. Yep. Yeah. We're going to get that and we're going to push and wiggle and push and smaller, bigger, smaller and out to really small little branches at the edges. It's going to bring those branches, try and keep them on the outside of the eyebrow. And up there. And then we're going to go down just a wee bit as well. It's almost got a slightly creepy factor so it would be a cool alternative mask for Halloween as well coming up. Now, of course, over here, we're just coming into spring. Not that I'm bragging or anything, but it's sort of... I've seen lots of autumn-inspired masks. I felt it was you know, a good time to try it for you fellas over there in the States. Okay, so we've got the tree branches down. Might make this one just a bit longer. Now I'm going to get... I've got a... Probably a quarter-inch... Um, brush, I don't know how big you can see that, and I'm going to get a Silly Farm, it's a Sandy Rose Cake, and I'm going to pick up just these end three colours, so I've got the dark, darkest colour and a orange, and I'm going to try and load my brush up reasonably well, you don't want it too wet so that it's dripping, but you want enough paint just so it's sort of a nice shiny colour, and I'm going to start on this side, and autumn leaves are kind of dried up and dragged, so you sort of do a jaggedy line. A bit more water for those. Yeah. And we're going to add those. Oh, and another one there. And just on the edges of some of those branches, just add some smaller leaves. And up here. Maybe some even blowing away that aren't attached. And some coming down back into the middle of the nose again. So we got try and get them nice and sharp edges as well. Alright, and we're gonna do them on the other side. So we add out these start with these bigger leaves down the bottom. And they don't have to be completely matching, but you just keep the general shape. And we add some on the tops of these branches up here too. And up around here. It's alright. Brush work's probably not the best upside down, but just so that you can see it, I'll make do. Right, so we've got the basic colour on. The last what we're going to do is just a few highlights. So we're going to get some white on my lower canal number two. We make sure that I'm nice and wet. That's number two, Mummy. That's a number two brush. And we're going to just put some dots, maybe some highlights along some of the leaves. Just really fine, sort of scribbly, sketchy type lines. And some dots just on those sharper points. Maybe a highlight along the branch every now and then. And 
coming down the inside of his eye too. It's almost, you're heading into the snowy wintry season, so almost snow flake type drops. Snow drops. It's snow drops, yeah. And you don't have to make these lines on all of them, it don't have to be perfect. Just keep them sort of quite spirit. And we're nearly done. Just highlight all those branches. And you see we've got a, a crispy baby in the background. I think he's probably ready for his sleep. Maybe just some of them put a little flick in the middle. And just some more drops coming out. And we're going to put some dots just in the inside corner of their eye just to fill out that space. And maybe some underneath as well. Alright, and that is quick and simple. We will add some, um, just a little bit of, we've got some red glitter today. So just going to add some of that. Just in some of the bigger leaves and in the corner of the eye. So it's quick and simple. And but very, very pretty. Here we go. Hope you enjoy that. Do you want to give a nice close up? Just sit nice and forward. Go, we go both sides. Good girl. There we go. Hope you enjoy that.